Hey, what's up guys? Tugi here, back again with a quick little update video. By the way, it's nice to be able to have this be an update video into some random gameplay or whatever, as I've had to do in the past. But anyway, what's happening? How are you? This video is just to kind of talk about, really quickly, the year that's been, how the channel's gone lately, and how I want the channel to go in the near future. So I will say, first and foremost, I mean, I'm recording this Christmas Eve, Thank you guys so much for the support this year, whether on YouTube and or Twitch. It's been pretty ridiculous. I mean, it was two years that I've been doing this uh, this past September, and I certainly didn't think that would be a thing. And talking about the success that we've had, and it's weird to call it success, but, you know, 7,000 subscribers. This year we passed over 1 million channel views. We got the invite to the content creator program. I got a short notice invite to go out to Burnaby to the EA offices that I, unfortunately I couldn't accept uh, because of the lack of a passport because I'm a loser that's never been anywhere. No, I just, I, who can afford to fly anywhere? I can't. I come from a lower middle class family. <laughs> but no, anyway, you get the point. It's been a very interesting year and I thank you guys so much for the support and I guess as cliched as it is to say, I'm looking forward to seeing what happens in the future, I guess. But uh, the, the main reason for this video is talking about what this channel's been lately and what I want it to be. And lately, flat out, the, the channel hasn't been exactly how I want it to be. Uh, and I'm trying to leave this as an unscripted video because I feel like that's the best way to get this message across. I used to take pride in having daily uploads, sometimes multiple daily uploads, and I've really struggled to hit that as of late. So you may have noticed over the past few weeks where I have just started throwing stuff against the wall just to see what sticks, just to see where the interest is, just to see what I'm interested in doing. And now that I've kind of done that, I've figured out what I want to move forward with, uh, the main series that I want to move forward with, and that way I can just grind out those videos and those series and get them to you a bit more regularly. Uh, aside from work, and streaming a lot uh, it's just I, I don't know I haven't had as much time to do this whereas before the whole twitch thing started uh, back in June it was literally just okay work and just grind out YouTube and now I've been trying to balance a little bit more it hasn't quite been what I want it to be I plan on getting it back to the level that I want this channel to be at which brings me to the future of this channel and the series that you guys are going to see moving forward. I tried to decide between two different words and I had trouble doing that. Some of you aren't going to be happy because a few series are ending. There are some new series, uh, there's a new series starting up and there's, there are some ones continuing. Bottom line, let's get, let's get down to this. Unfortunately, uh, I love the Liverpool series. We're, we're going to cut that. <sighs> That's not the kicker. Be a pro's done, which is tough because the interest is absolutely there from you guys, and I thank you for that. Be a pro is just not my thing. It just isn't. I've tried to record the next episode four times. Four times, and midway through the episode every time, I just sit here, and I'm like, man, I am bored, like just flat out bored, and I don't feel like I can make Be a Pro entertaining. Some guys are great at making Be A Pro entertaining. I just don't feel like I'm one of those people, uh, at least for me. And if I'm wrong on that, and it's at least entertaining enough for you guys, which apparently it has been based on the views, that's awesome. But I, I've i sat here and I've tried to think of a way uh, to, to make Be A Pro interesting for me, and that was the head-to-head -head idea. And even now, it's just trying to record. Every episode kind of broke down into just hating on the AI. Hating on the AI. Hating on the AI some more. That's all it was. And I'm just, I'm not happy with it. So, as much as I'd love to continue that series, because the interest is definitely there from you guys, it just, it doesn't make sense if I'm not going to be enjoying it. And like I said, I want to really kind of put my focus into a few main series and just grind the hell out of those and bring more frequent uploads with all of those and unfortunately, Be A Pro is not going to be a part of those plans, as again, I tried to decide between multiple different words. Have you noticed that yet? It's pretty sweet, isn't it? It is pretty sweet. Uh, anyway, uh, after, after you know, 
telling you about one series ending, why not tell you about two more series that are ending <clears throat> effective immediately? They're done. Montreal and Hartford, they're done. I'm sorry. I know some of you still wanted to see both continue. I feel like both are still in a fairly good point. I just noticed how much of that sign right there is shining off of the light. That's that's ridiculous. I need to fix the lighting in this room. I'll get around to it eventually. One of these days, I'll start acting like I actually post videos and stream on Twitch. With Montreal, the fact is we failed. The team is in a pretty damn good spot, but... I, I feel like with both series, I mean, with Hartford, at least we found success. But with Hartford, it's just like, okay, grind out a couple more seasons just to see if we can win. Same thing with Montreal, grind out a couple more seasons. I just feel like they've both ran their course. I, I can't help but feel that way. And for those who wanted to see those series continue, I'm sorry that they're ending. But I do appreciate the support on those series. And let's just say the new series is going to be starting up very soon. I think you're going to like it one way or another. So please give that a chance. As far as the Hall of Fame goes for both of those series, here's what we're going to do. I got I don't know what the hell's going on right there. In the comments, I'm going to post two comments. Surprise. One's going to say Montreal, one's going to say Hartford. Reply to those comments with players that you think deserve to be up for Hall of Fame voting. Man, this is killing me, but I'm still going to one take this. Reply with players that you think deserve to be up for Hall of Fame voting. The next episode of each series will be the polls, and then we'll have the finale with Hall of Fame inductees. Potentially. I don't know if anyone's going to get into the Hall of Fame from either series. We'll talk more about those, uh, you know, about the players, about the teams, and about the series in general on the next episode of both of those. But indeed, both of those series are ending. So just to recap, Liverpool's done, Batman's done too. Let's be honest here. And I've, I've talked about this on stream quite a bit, right? Uh, unfortunately, if I'm not doing something NHL related, whether that be NHL or FHM, the views just aren't there. I would love for them to be, but they're just not. So for me, it's like, okay, well, I'm just going to push that to the side and focus on what you guys want to see. Which, hopefully, one day we get to the point where I can sit here and it's not that I don't enjoy playing NHL and FHM. I obviously do. But, you know, it'd be nice to play some other things from time to time. But we'll we'll get to it eventually. We'll get to it eventually. Now, for now, the goal is to bring you guys uh, more of what you want to see. But again, Batman's over. Liverpool's over. Be a pro. Montreal. Hartford. Those are over, unfortunately. Which means we are continuing with three series. I'm going to keep giving Ready to Rumble a chance. The FHM 4 Road to Glory will continue, and there will be a new franchise mode series starting up very, very soon. And I think you guys will like it. I'm looking forward to seeing your feedback for that one, so keep an eye out. Those will be the three series that I continue to, uh, you know, that I continue to go with, and that hopefully I can get back to the normal uploads and you know kind of kind of work out my schedule between balancing the youtube you know between balancing the youtube and you know, between balancing youtube twitch and everything else i think that pretty much covers it i think i don't know like i said this was an unscripted video obviously obviously but i feel like that's the best way to go for a channel update why take something way too seriously but if i forget to mention anything or if i forgot to mention anything throughout the course of this video uh, i will mention it down in the comment section as well but again uh make sure to respond to both the montreal and the hartford post down in that same section i'm struggling to think of anything that i may have or may or may not have forgotten i have no idea we'll see let's just end this shall we to recap i thank you for your support I look forward, and I am looking forward, very much looking forward to what's coming up next, and I hope you guys are too. Thank you for all that you've done for me in 2017. Looking forward to 2018. It's scary to say that. 2018, it's only a few short days away. Have a good one, guys. Take it easy, and keep an eye out for that new series.